<laughs> right? That when you guys started dating, yeah. he was married. Is that true? No. Well, I mean, obviously, because he's not divorced, like legally, mm -hmm. but that takes that does take a long time for that to happen. Yes, yeah. it's a long process, mm -hmm. you know. And I mean, I feel like we've seen celebrities go through. I mean, obviously, I have to make celebrities an example because it's known to the public. We've seen people who are have filed for divorce, whatever, but they still continue with their lives and they do get into relationships. So that's the situation my partner and I are in. Um, it is the reality of things and, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I... Was that so... <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I, I think you made it clear. But for also, people. the thing yeah. is, I also feel like there's no need... I mean, I've watched and I've let people say whatever they want because at the end of the day, I'm not going to be clarifying something that's not my situation. Mm -hmm. I'm dating him. Okay. You know, everything else, I feel like I don't have a right to speak on because it's not my situation. If there's anyone who ever wants to clarify, it should be the parties who are involved in that situation. Yeah, but this situation, you are also involved. I'm I asked involved. about you. I asked I'm about you being him. involved with him. Oh yeah. Yeah, I didn't ask the other questions. You know. Oh okay. Yeah. And 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 you made it clear for people because maybe they might be just. Yeah, but assuming... I mean, like even generally clarifying things like, oh, is he still married? Like, not kicking a guy. Yo, yeah, but Kuban sa hokol kena guy. Kuban sa hokol kena guy. What does that mean? I don't know what's. <laughs> 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 who, who told you Nagi Kenagai? No, I mean, okay, never mind. No, Next but do you know question. what that means? When no Kenagai? Yeah, where do I come in? Yes. Yeah. So, Why am I in it? Yes. Yes. Um, so I'm I'm saying when no Kenagai Tabing, because obviously your name is in there, yeah. you know? And unfortunately, we uh, are. Don't make me the face of a situation that has I'm not. To do I'm not. With but me. Unfortunately, no, I'm not saying you, yeah. I'm saying generally, like okay, public cool. perception has gotten to that. And unfortunately, like people would be interested in. Hi guys and welcome to the Coffee Beans Club. If you're new here, please don't forget to smash that subscribe button. So uh, you guys, Umishali, honestly, I don't know what planet she's from at this point, you guys. As you would have seen in the clip, she denies dating a married man currently, but she also goes on to say he's only married because the divorce has not been finalized. So she just is out here actually trying to, trying to confuse the enemy. But the problem, you guys, is that we know for a fact that Uli Roy last year posted Umeri Jane on Valentine's Day, surprising him in his office, you guys. And we do know that fast forward to this year, early March, Michali posts the same thing, you know, surprising Uli Roy in his office for their one year anniversary, you guys. So I'm finding it very hard to believe that between uh, February 14th last year and early March, those first two weeks of March, Uli Roy was suddenly not in love with his wife anymore and things were over, you guys. I'm finding it so hard to believe because you guys will remember after news broke out that Omichal is in fact dating a married man last year. Leroy still went on to post Mary Jane in May, you guys, the same May, just a few months after we found out Michali is dating him. He went on to actually post Mary Jane and to say happy Mother's Day, you guys. So last year from February up until May, we know that Uli Roy was not done with his wife at some point or another. Things were not all the way done, you guys, because he went from being really cordial and um, a approaching the situation very respectfully sort of for a married man who's cheating but then he turns around a few months later towards end of last year and it's like a war has now been launched towards his wife you guys from his actions of course that we saw on social media but before then only Roy seemed to very much still be in a good place with his wife I don't know if perhaps he was just trying to be out here and confuse us as the public and make it seem like, no, he has nothing to do with all those rumors and allegations. But yeah, it is only towards the end of last year that he started showing his true colors, you guys. So there we have it from Umichali. What an awkward exchange, you guys. She doesn't even know how to explain this thing. Anyway, Coffee Beans, let me know in the comments down below what you make of this story. You know I love to hear from you and I'll see you in the next one.